Anyway, so I'm down there in the Zamboni entrance. You have to wait until RDS slash TSN is done with mm. their main interviews until the chumps are allowed on the ice, a.k.a. me. <laughs> so eventually we're allowed on the ice. Um, and then interview Justin comes into play. And I'm thinking two guys, Patrick Waugh, Patrick Waugh, Roy? I say Waugh. Yeah, Patrick Waugh. Waugh. Yeah. Patrick Waugh. And Davis Cooper. Davis Cooper from Halifax, played with the Max, um, have a little bit of a history with them, went to Telus Cup with him in Thunder Bay like five mm. years ago. Um, so quick little interview with him. Not too nervous about that. Have a couple questions. I was messaging dudes. I was like, dudes, what do I ask uh, Waugh? What do I ask Davis? He was home, so we had a good understanding of watching from TV. He had a little bit more composure than I did. Mm -hmm. Had a couple great questions, so I relayed them to Wa. And here's the thing about when after, it's a lot of French media interviewing Wa. So I don't really want to be in the scrum because, one, I don't really know what he's saying. And, two, I don't want to switch over to an English question as everyone's recording in French because they're on French TV so I just I just didn't mm. go to school for media. I don't know the yeah. rules for a media scrum, how it works. You know, all these guys there, they're in suits. They got seven year degrees. Yeah, I'm there in my Patagonia <laughs> yellow rain jacket. Just hey man, what's you know mustard I, colored? You know, I'm just I'm trying to do my best here. Yeah. So I let the scrum finish with the French media, and I hover very very similar to Tom Bernard. You, you hover, you mm -hmm. linger. And I'm a lingerer. Mm -hmm. And you wait for that scrum to be over. Eventually, it's over. And you kind of feel bad because you want to let him celebrate with his team. But I couldn't let that happen. So I said, excuse me, Mr. Wa Mr. Waugh, do you mind if I just grab a couple photo, a couple questions in English? And he wasn't overly thrilled, but he was just like, yeah, no problem. Let me go. Sure, that, that's fine. I'll do it. And I saw him look down at my um, – I had my Montreal golf – quarter zip on yeah and i and he because he was looking for like what part of the media i was with because yeah. i didn't have my media pass on or anything no I was high just, button i had nothing yeah. out there i was just it was just me and i saw him look down and i saw him look up and he was just a little confused because i had my iphone and i wasn't like recording because <laughs> because all these guys have um audio uh -huh. recorders and i'm just there with my iphone put it on wide boom here we go and I just essentially asked him how the crowd was in Halifax, and he answered tremendously. He said that he, the, the crowd here was awesome. He was uh, a really, really, really nice guy, understanding, and he's very thoughtful in his details. Even that, and his he's thoughtful in his answers. Even when he was answer, answering in French, I don't really know what he's saying, but I, I could pick up that he was very detail oriented with every single word that he was coming out even with the the other media even though all this is going on he wants to mm. celebrate with his team he was very he was very patient and understanding with the media which he was with me even though he probably didn't really want to speak to me after just talking for 10 minutes with the french media yeah but even just getting those two questions in with him he, it was a it was a cool experience arguably one of the yeah i guess you could say it's an interview arguably one of the biggest interviews i've ever done yeah even though it was only two minutes yeah just not even two minutes but 30 seconds if that mm -hmm. but uh very very cool uh individual didn't think i thought he'd be a little bit more standoffish but he was just open just yeah how are you yeah absolutely well, i guess he just won a championship yeah. so it's hard to be pissed yeah. off yeah i was about to say i think that was his first championship with them I don't yeah think it was. Ever, so you've probably got him at one of the happiest moments he's had in the last 10 years yeah it's a good <laughs> in point. that like literally 30 seconds after hugging his team captain or whatever yeah. so you caught him at a good a good time but no he was great and 